Hello, this is Peter from First Maths, and today we're looking at counting objects into groups. Today you're going to need 0 to 10 number cards, enough for one per child. Small cardboard box for the bus, and a shallow tray for the boat. Some world figures, pot lids, small or wooden beads, mental learning objective. I can read numbers. I can find numbers which are more than or less than a given number. Mental learning task. Play. Sit down, stand up. Give each child a number card and ask them all to stand up. Sit down if you're holding a card with a number 5. Sit down if you're holding a number less than 8. So those children sit down. Your teacher will give you more number instructions. Pause the video and play the game. Who has to stand up the most? Who sat down the most? Pause the video and answer the questions. Mental learning objective. I can read numbers. I can find numbers which are more than or less than a given number. Main learning objective. I can split or partition a small number of objects into two groups. Main learning task. Today we are learning about addition. We will count collections of objects to find out how many there are all together. Today we are going to separate a collection of things into two groups. Today we will work again in two groups. Group 1. Younger children working with a classroom assistant. Group 2. Older children with a teacher around the table. Group 1. Today you are going to play buses and boats, which is my favourite game. Take turns to pick up five or less world figures. Count how many you have. How many on the bus? How many on the boat? Are there more on the boat or bus? Pause the video and play the game. Group 2. Each child needs two plastic pot lids and a collection of beads in a dish. Shuffle the number cards. Show the top card. Everyone read the number. Split the number of beads between the two lids. So example, if you see the number 5, you might have 2 beads in one and 3 beads in the other, because 2 plus 3 make 5. Pause the video and play the game. Group 2. How did you decide how many to add? How many would you add if you added 0 to 1 lid? Challenge. The children can recall their partitioning by drawing the lids and the beads. Write the numbers in each lid. Pause the video and have a try. Write the total number of beads. Pause the video again and have a try. Main learning objective. I can split or partition a small number of objects into two groups. Plenary at the end of the lesson. Show what group one has done. Act out a boat and bus story using children. Pause the video and have some fun. Six children are animals. Put them into different sets 
some in the bus and some on the boat. Pause the video and play the game. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a like below. Please subscribe to my channel and also press the notification bell to be informed every time I upload a math resource. Because I'm always uploading new ideas, plans, quizzes, puzzles, and I would like you to know exactly when I have uploaded them. So I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye!